A bipartisan legislation deal on health care doesn't seem to be getting much bipartisan support. Senators Lamar Alexander and Patty Murray negotiated the deal. It would fund key Obamacare subsidies in exchange for allowing states more flexibility to regulate health care coverage. Senate Minority Leader Chuck Schumer tweeted the deal had broad support from Democrats in the Senate. And House Minority Leader Nancy Pelosi called it good news for families across America. But the deal doesn't seem to be getting that same sweeping support from Republicans. Senators Susan and Collins, Lisa Murkowski, and Mike Rounds are some of the GOP lawmakers backing the deal. But others are strongly against, including Representative Mark Walker, who tweeted, The GOP should focus on repealing and replacing Obamacare, not trying to save it. This bailout is unacceptable. Senate Majority Leader Mitch McConnell didn't take a position on the deal Tuesday. Meanwhile, President Donald Trump initially seemed to support the Alexander Murray deal during a press conference Tuesday. For a period of one year, two years, we will have a very good solution. Wednesday morning, Trump refused to back the deal, tweeting he can never support bailing out insurance companies who made a fortune with Obamacare. The Alexander Murray deal is still just a proposal. The senators hope to present the legislation as early as this week.